That got a little sketchy for a second there. I'm hitting balance point, I'm just getting choppy as fuck when I'm up. I'm showing a fuck ton of improvement though. I'm pretty happy with it. Yeah. I'm thirsty though. Maybe that's the problem. How can I be expected to do wheelies when my palate is parched? This is bullshit. Can't work under these conditions. And by work, I mean fucking around. Scraping that skid plate. <laughs> that felt good. <laughs> Getting there, I'm showing improvement. Lady on that foot, on that uh, Porsche didn't look too happy with me though. That's the case, she doesn't know what an improvement I'm showing. Otherwise, I'm sure she'd be very happy about me doing wheelies past her house. further back. Nope. Oh! Ah! My nuts did not appreciate that landing. Alright. Whew. That was my best wheelie. That's that, not that last one, it was the one before it. Land squarely on my testicles, though. That oh, is not a preferred landing, but it beats landing on my the head on my shoulders. Dick jokes and motorcycles go hand in hand. boys. Not the Harley boys. The Harley boys. Alright. Cool guys. Cool guys on cool bikes. Fat. If it's a Harley and the guy doesn't wave, he's a douchebag on a shitty bike. If he does wave, he's a cool guy on a cool bike. The attitude of the rider totally depends whether or not the bike itself is cool or not. I don't know how that works. But it does. It happens every time. Like, I could be going by on a busted-ass 883 running on one cylinder. I'd be like, cool bike, bro. Thanks for waving. Same thing goes for can ams and trikes. So here's my philosophy. Stop talking. A train of thought derailed. Um, yeah, fuck drinking. This is gonna be my new high. This and shrooms. I need to learn how to change fork seals. 
because I'm going to beat this bike to death. You know, I feel like I'm, I'm definitely getting faster the more I ride. But after riding the Harley for so long, like one and a half seasons. Ooh, hoo hoo! <laughs> Back end got kind of fucking squirrely on me. But, uh... Yeah, what the fuck was I saying? Yeah, I probably am getting faster, but I feel like I'm running so much slower than I was on the Harley. Probably because I was at the limit of what that fucking Harley could do. In my hands, anyway. Like, when you're scraping every fucking corner, you know, improvements in body position only get you so far on the fucking cruiser. So I, I could probably go a little faster on the Harley than I used to be able to. But I'm definitely faster on this, but there's so much room for improvement on this. I feel like I'm fucking up everything I do. But that's probably a good thing. At least I know I've got room to grow on this bike. Ooh, third gear power wheels. I had room to grow on the Harley, but it would have been exponentially more expensive and I still wouldn't have ended up with something that performed as highly as this bike. I wish I had a switch that would go between the sound this thing makes and the sound the Harley makes. Because you cannot beat a Harley for fucking sounding beautiful. Don't you move truck. Don't you move. Like this. Giving up drinking is gonna be good. I need to probably think of it like I thought of uh, doing the tank work. Like I get pissed off and frustrated and hate it when I was doing it, and then immediately after, I'd be like, "Oh man, glad we got that done. How crazy was that shit? Got through it though." And we pat each other on the back and have a good time. But at the time, it sucks. That's probably gonna. You know, gonna be like this is. It's probably gonna suck for a little while, and it'll probably suck occasionally. But I'll probably look back and go, damn, it was a good thing we did that. Worst bridge ever built. God, every time. Time for some power. Please. Yeah, power wheelies! I don't know why I always say wheelie. Sucks Jason doesn't really do power wheelies because every little bump in the road becomes like a little ramp. Like a his, it probably ride on forever doing that shit. Oh, I got a bug in my helmet. How did you get in there? Why is there a fucking bug in my helmet? It's out on the sides. There's a fucking bug in my helmet still! The motherfucker's like getting inside my goddamn ear. Ah, oh, it's their fucking shoulder. God damn that tickles. Whoop. Ooh. 
Oh. 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 Arch nemesis, man. He's not Ant Man, he's Ant Ant! An ant with the incredible power to have the strength of one ant. He can also shrink himself to exactly the size of one ant. Cleverly disguised as a common ant. He's nearly impossible to pick out amongst the other millions of ants. The only way you know it's him is he gets inside of your fucking helmet tries to infiltrate my ear hole like a fucking insect rapist for ears. All right, why don't you guys get a ton of room in front of me. And then, if you look in your rear view mirror, you'll see a guy trying to do wheelies. Unsuccessfully. Now, I've always wanted to do a wheelie with my feet up like this. <laughs> Man. 